yet another video today i'll be showing you how to fix every errors or broken dependencies in your kali machine automatically without within few minutes okay so um if you install the new kali machine uh, this video is for you uh, if your installation is not new but you want to fix uh, the broken dependencies uh, those broken dependencies in most cases uh, makes a lot of your tools uh, in Kali and not to function very well and then this video is for you also so I'll be using a, a tool called uh, Pimp My Kali to get this job done so what you have to do is go to your search engine uh, just type um, go to your browser then type Pimp My Kali okay uh, then you search um, so it's this you choose this um, so this is what we are looking for and look at the usage and when you scroll down you can see the uh, installation guide and how to use it so uh, what are we going to do is um uh, okay just copy this uh, the command go to your terminal uh please uh you can use sudo please you have to use sudo but for me i'll be switching users sudo so okay and you put your password uh if you don't want to run roots you can just use a sudo a command just like this sudo then you paste the command okay since i'm already in root then i'll just uh, run it git cloning okay uh, so you can see it's done so when you ls when you list the content and you can see uh, pimp my call is here so I already have it before, so this is pimp my calling. So you can just uh, cd to uh, the directory pimp my calling. Okay. Um, when you cd there, um, just play it okay when you ls uh you can see pimp my kali so let's go to the documentation now so you, you cd to the directory and then you run this uh command this is how to run it up okay so we see paste it here uh pimp my kali and we let it do its stuff so as you can see uh it's running now so for those uh who has a new you have new installation you see the lot, lot of stuff is going to fix so for those who have a new installation uh what you have to do is just uh press this you you press n okay you just uh use n of uh, okay so wait for those who have uh this you just press and wait uh, my screen is kind of small no let me run it again please think my colleague and you run it in okay it brings out this so what you have to do in these instances this is if you have a new installation you just do this okay even if it's an old if it's your first time of running it just puts uh the end so i'll just uh, clear my screen a bit uh, and so when you put the end uh it starts uh helping you out to do those things as you can see it's running uh apps updates okay so it's going to fix a lot of dependencies so it's going to take time anyway around five to ten minutes do i have done this before so why doing the installation you get to a point where uh, it's going to ask you um if you 
want to log in as uh, root uh, so just like the previous version of Kali it's always a uh, on login page and when you're logging in uh, you go straight to root so it's really going to ask you the same thing so if you want to run it that way it's okay you can say yes okay but for best security practices I I advise you just say no but you're not using your Kali for complex stuff, uh, so you can say yes if you want. Then after that, it's going to get you another question, which is if you choose, if you it's going to ask you if you're going to, if you like to copy your files from Kali folder to the root folder. So you just choose no, then just let it run. That's it. Everything is fixed. So you take a snapshot of this uh, installation, then you save it. Uh, okay so i believe it's really going to fix a whole lot almost all uh, of your broken dependencies all right uh, if you haven't subscribed to this channel uh, please do subscribe to this channel and kindly share uh, also for to create uh, for other people to uh, learn from it all right peace out